This is Math Expressions Unit 3, Lesson 2, and let's start off by writing your first name, your class number, and then the date that you're working on this page over here. So if you need to, pause the video, get that down, and then when you're ready to go, start the video back up. Okay, so in this lesson, we are going to build and discuss other numbers. And for this lesson, you are going to need what Math Expressions calls the secret code cards that are on page 189A through 189D. So you're going to need to have those all cut out and ready to work with. So if you need to stop the video, pause the video, whatever, uh, to get those ready, go ahead and do that. And then when you're ready, so let's start the video back up. Okay, so you can see that I have my cards cut out and I have them in order 100 to 900, 10 to 90, 1 to 9 here, so that they're easy to for me to figure out where they are. If you have the space, you could also just kind of lay them all out so that they're, you could see them and get them easily. For right now, I'm going to just scooch mine up out of the way, up out of this workspace way so that we can use this space to work with. All right, so let's come back now to our page and it says to write the number. And so we're gonna need to find the cards 720 and nine. So if you go ahead and pause the video if you need to, find those and then start the video back up. All right, so here are my cards 700 20 and 9 and we are going to add those together so now if we were to add them using like an algorithm what we would do is we would line them up like this and I actually made a little thing up here to show us the digits that are in the ones these are the digits in the ones place these are the digits that are in the tens place and then over here are the digits that are in the hundreds place so if we were to add them up, go straight down, 0 plus 0 plus 9 would be 9, 0 plus 2 would be 2, and 7, nothing added on. But what we can also do is we can layer these on top of each other like this. So now we have the 7 still in the hundreds place, the 2 is still in the tens place, and the 1, or, or the 9 is still in the ones place. So now we can see that that number when we put it all together is 729. And that's what you are supposed to do over here. So we're going to write the number 729. Okay. And now for the rest of the problems, two through six, that's what I want you to do. I want you to use your number cards to first off build those numbers and then write what number those add up to. So go ahead, pause the video, and then when you're ready to go, you can start the video back up. All right, so now we're going to come down to this section here. And in this section, you are going to need to use your, um, your secret code cards to kind of start off where we ended. So I need my 500 card. I'll show you this one. So we're going to work on number seven here. I need my 500 card. I need my 80 card. Get them lined up like this. And then I need my five card. So this time they're wanting us to start off like this. So we have those ready to go. And what they're wanting us to do, and this is why they're called, they call these expanded numbers, expanded form. What it wants us to do is to break these apart, to go like this. So we'll take this away. And now we've, we've exploded that. We've expanded it, is the term. So now we have 585. So we're kind of doing the reverse of what we did up above. So we're going to write 500 plus 80 plus 5. That's the expanded form. That's in one way. The other way is we need to go five hundreds, eight tens, and then five ones. So that's writing the expanded form in two different ways. So that's what you're supposed to do for eight and nine using your cards. 
and you're going to need to make sure that you have your your thousands card ready to go so um, go ahead and pause or stop the video and uh, make sure that's done and then when you're ready to go yeah don't stop the video and then when you're ready to go start it back up and we'll go on to the next page all right so let's go ahead and go on to the next page and let's write our first name our student number and the date that you're working on this page up there so go go ahead and pause the video if you need to and then start it back up when you're ready all right so we're going to see our friend puzzled penguin again it says what's the error of course there's usually errors and the letter says dear math students i was asked to build the number 238 with secret code cards and i made the number with these cards and then down here it says my teacher says that I show that what I showed is not correct. Can you help me? Your friend puzzled penguin. All right. So down here, write your answer. What, what did puzzled penguin do wrong? What, sh what should he have done differently? So pause the video, go ahead and do that. And then when you're ready to go, start the video back up. All right. So now, Last thing on this lesson, check our understanding. So this says down here, it says, use the numbers, the number 456, to complete the sentences. It says to build the number with secret code cards to check your answer. So the value right here, the value of the digit 4 is what? So what is 4 worth in that number, 456? The value of the digit 5 is what? What is that worth? And then the value of the digit 6 is what? What's the value of that 6? So that's the end of the lesson. So go ahead and uh, do that. And then that's the end of lesson 2.